What is going on guys? Marty here. Welcome back to Snappy Videos. We have something really cool to open here on today's video. We have the Yu-Gi-Oh! Collector's Edition 25th Anniversary Box. This is really cool. There's some cool cards in here that I remember from when I was a kid collecting these. This is going to be really cool. There's a few booster packs in here as well as some other pretty cool cards. This is awesome. I didn't quite get it on the day it was released because I ordered it online so it came a couple days later. But I am so excited. I am ready to open this. So let's not waste any time. Let's get over the table. Let's see exactly what it says on the box it has in here. Let's open it up. And let's let the nostalgia flow. All right, guys, here we go. Unfortunately, there's a fly buzzing around the office. I tried to kill it. He won't go away and he's outrun me. Outsmarted by a fly, unfortunately. Anyway, if you hear a buzzing noise, that's what that is. We're all good. All right, here it is. This box looks so cool. Look how shiny it is. I almost just don't want to open it. It looks that good. All right, cool. So we've seen these cards. Uh, hopefully, you guys know what these cards are here. Anyway, let's check out the back. So there's several booster, uh, booster packs that are going to be inside. So we have one of each of these six. And I remember almost all of these from when I was a kid as well. All right, again, as we saw on the front, we have the three Egyptian God cards, uh, the original versions. I don't know if there's other versions. I stopped collecting them a while ago. We also have the Blue Eyes White Dragon. You used to love that. I had so many of those. Dark Magician and the Red Eyes Black Dragon. Plus, you also get one of those six cards as a bonus seven card in the new quarterly. Okay. All right. So we're going to open this up now. So this is, again, the Legendary Collection 25th Anniversary Edition. I'm gonna find something to carefully break through this here, unless I can do it with my finger now. Oh, I got it, perfect. That way we don't damage the box too much. Awesome. All right, take that off. Let's check out the box. Now I'll get that out of there. This box is nice and shiny. I love this, this looks really cool. Wow, look how shiny they are. All right, I have washed my hands before doing this, so I don't like to get the cards dirty. Check out like all the hieroglyphics on the side. They've gone into great detail with this. All right, let's set that aside. And again here, you can see it all the way around the box and even inside the box here. All right, setting the, setting the box up here so you can see that, you know, set these in here really nicely to keep the cards pretty safe there. All right, so you can see uh, Obelisk the Tormentor there, but he's also at the back, very sparkly. So I'm guessing that's the extra card that we get. As I said, one of these six cards. All right, we'll open this up in a minute and see the cool cards we've got in here. Limited edition as well. All right, as for in here though, guys, we have one of each booster pack. And we're going to be opening each of these today, which is going to be really cool. Man, I remember these cards. Oh. All right, what else is inside this box? All right, the box is empty from there. And the hieroglyphics only go just into the top bit there. Still looks cool. It would be nice to go all the way down the box. That would be awesome. All right, let's reassemble this and let's put this back together and put it out of the way. All right, guys. Well, I think we should do the booster packs last because we don't know what's going to be in them. So that leaves something cool for the rest of the video. Let's open this up now. And let's have a look at what cards we get inside of here. All right, just being very careful there not to bump them too much. Get that plastic out of the way. All right, Obelisk the Tormentor. It looks pretty cool. I never actually had this card. I did want it uh, when I was younger. Limited edition, as we saw before. Alright, oh, Slap of the Sky Dragon. It looks really cool too. Wow. The Winged Dragon of Ra. Oh, there's that fly. I think you see it on the camera. Go away. I think he likes Yu-Gi-Oh cards as well. Alright, that looks really cool. I like that. The Blue Eyes White Dragon. Man, this is like one of my favoriteest cards. That is so cool. I love that. That is awesome. Again, limited edition down there. The Dark Magician. Wow. Again, I had this card as well, and I also had the Red Eyes Black Dragon. I love the shiny effect of like the sky or whatever it is behind the dragon. That's cool. Not sure it's meant to be. It looks like there's a line down here from printing. I'm not sure you can see on the camera. And Obelisk the Tormentor. That's cool, very sparkly, very cool. And the back of the card is in fact blue. Check that out, a couple of lines in there. I don't know if that's just poor print quality or what that is. All right, let's get these cards and let's sit them to the side. Now, I don't remember all of the Yu-Gi-Oh cards that well, but I do have some good ones. I do want to leave this one until last. And which other one did I remember? That one second last. All right, the rest of these, let's open up. All right, Metal Raiders. All right. So this, again, is a 25th anniversary edition. So let's have a look at what's in this one. 
Ah, oh, this is cool. I'm excited. All right, guys. Here we go. Does it say 25th anniversary? I mean, it's copyright 2020, so at least you can see that. All right. Definitely remember that card. Oh, baby dragon. Now that's bringing back memories. That's cool. I remember that one as well. All right, that's our first pack down. Now, I don't know how, I can't remember how to tell the rarity and stuff of these. So if you know, leave it in the comments below. But we'll put that away for now. All right, this is Spell Ruler. All right, let's see. What are we getting in this one? That looks cool. I remember having this one. I think I had like a dragon sort of deck. Might have even been with my blue eyes or something. All right, a shiny name going on there. Upstart Goblin. All right, cool. That's the next pack down. What is next? The Pharaoh's Servant. Yeah. All right, what are we getting in here? Let's have a look. It's a pretty cool box so far, I like it. All right. I feel like I've had that one before as well. Respect play. Light Force Sword. All right, we haven't had any like crazy cool cards jump out at us yet. So it's just been some pretty average looking stuff. Unless you guys are like, they're like, oh wow Marty, you got that, that's so cool. And I just haven't noticed because I don't probably know all my Yu-Gi-Oh cards that well. Um, but no, I don't think we have got anything too crazy yet. Heart of the Underdog. That looks familiar. That looks cool. I like the look of that. But again, doesn't look like anything too crazy. Salvage. I feel like I might add that as well. All right. Now, under the two that I want to keep for last. This one just... I think it's got Exodia in the background, actually. I remember having um, some sort of Exodia. It wasn't like the Forbidden one. It was like a different one. I remember getting that out of probably this type of pack. And the Blue Eyes one, I'm going to leave that to last because I love the Blue Eyes White Dragon. Imagine if we got one out of there. That'd be so cool. All right, Yu-Gi-Oh! Dark Crisis. Let's have a look. Oh, I had this panda. He looks so cool, so familiar. All right. That looks familiar too, actually. Well, that looks cool. That thing looks pissed off, though. All right, guys. Nothing too crazy from that one either. But we are getting a few cards here and I have now have a cool box to put them in, so that's cool. Although these probably will go into sleeves, let's be honest. All right. Legend of the Blue Eyes White Dragon. Let's have a look, guys. Get excited. That looks familiar. I think I got a few of these booster packs when I was a kid, actually. That, definitely I had a few of those. Actually, I think that came in the first ever packet I had. I remember the first packet of Yu-Gi-Oh cards I ever got actually kept in its, like, you know, like the foil packaging it came in and kept them really safe, and that was one of them. It looks familiar, but, yeah. Oh, I definitely had that. Flame Ghost, Zombie Fusion, right? Ray and Temperature. That is cool, guys. Ah, so many little memories there. Just like I feel like I can remember opening packets and finding some of those. Let's have another look through these cards we got. So the Red Eyes Black Dragon. That's definitely going in a sleeve somewhere. The Dark Magician. Again, the effects on that card are so cool. Blue Eyes, White Dragon. One of the coolest cards I ever had. I did have like a Dark Paladin I got out of a, uh, like a booster pack, like Dark Magician and uh, Buster Blade or something fused into it. That was really cool as well. I love that card. I think I sold that a few years ago, unfortunately. All right, Wing Dragon of Ra. Love it. Always wanted that card. All right, and the other gods here as well, Egyptian gods. And Obelisk the Tormentor in like a crazy sparkly form. Whoa, look at that. 25th anniversary showing up there. Is that any of the others? No, it's just here on him. I wonder what that's actually worth, being that you get a random one in your box, right? You have to buy three and hope for the best. So you might actually have to buy more than three just to get them all. That's pretty cool. 
Anyway guys, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, smash the like button. Make sure you subscribe to Snaffy videos so we'll be doing a lot more cool content. And I'll see you guys in the next amazing video.